Oh man, so let's change lanes quickly now as we get back into the kitchen because Zoe, I know you love a peppercorn sauce and because it is a frugal feasting Monday, what we're gonna do is um, we're gonna use uh, uh, the leftover steak that we had from the weekend, you're yeah, right. Um, but if you happen <laughs> to have a, a beautiful steak sitting ready to be eaten, we're gonna zhuzh it up with a little bit of a peppercorn sauce because you do love a peppercorn sauce. Uh, a good peppercorn sauce with a great steak, it always goes well together. And what I love about this is we're actually gonna use fresh peppercorn, so I'm not gonna waste any time. I've got one tablespoon of butter, okay? Pan's kind of medium hot. Um, we want that butter to melt nicely, uh, but you don't want it too hot because we're going to add a tablespoon of flour and we don't want the flour to uh, kind of um, fry and cook too quickly in that butter. Uh, so that's See, I thought you would mix everything beforehand before popping it into the fry, uh, to the It pan. just requires constant, constant stirring. Okay. So I'm going to just so keep doing that. And what I'm going to ask you to do... Should I stir? Um, um, I'm going to stir as you gently add the milk. Okay. okay. And we're using our Clover Fresh Full Cream Milk because you've got to. You've got to. There we go. There you go. Just keep that going, keep that going. Can I add more? Yeah, yeah, keep it going, keep it going. And you're going to just keep stirring a little bit more. And we're just gonna, that should be fine. Whoa, whoa, yeah, that should be there fine. We and we're go. gonna just gradually let this thicken. Um, and it's, I know it might seem a bit painstaking, but this really doesn't take a huge amount of time. And you can see now the flour is starting to blend in there quite nicely. Now, what I love about the fresh peppercorns, I mean, you can use any peppercorns, but the fresh peppercorn, it's got such a lovely bite to it. And it's gradually starting to thicken. It can go a little bit further. Okay. Um, but this, it really does have a beautiful crunch to it and obviously an incredible um, flavor. And you're gonna get such a lovely mix of textures there. Um, can probably do with thickening a little bit more. Then do you want to put in a little pinch of salt? A pinch of salt. Oh, yummy. There you go. Um, and you can let the flavors infuse, but what really is good about this is you want kind of the, that balance of having the, the creamy sauce with the nice bite and snap of the peppercorns. Yes. Um, and we'll put some pepper on at the end. I was about to ask, do you add even, you know, oh, ground pepper? You know, pepper? that you can really do for taste, okay? And this, I would probably let thicken just a little bit more, but that's starting to, to look quite nice. So what we've got here is um, we did a run steak. I was up all night um, frying this rump <laughs> steak. Um, and again, it's your preference. I like to go with the rump. Um, very rare. Um, and because I, if I have any left over, I want to be able to put that um, on a slice of bread. I'm going to make sure I get some of these peppercorns. Okay, um, there you go. And our keyword dun, for this dun, dun, morning dun, dun. is eat. Wow. If you'd love to have the recipe sent to your phone, just send it to 33728. Oh, that keyword is eat. Okay, I'll turn that around. And I've got a bit of rocket. Rocket always goes so beautifully um, with our steak. We're going to pop a little bit of that on top. Um, a little bit of olive oil, um, which we know is in its healthiest state when you're having it uncooked or unheated. There just pop a bit of that on it. And this is when you add, just to complete the pepperiness of that. Um, if it was a, a, a kind of a ribeye steak or something like that, I'd probably fry the steak for a little bit longer to render the fat into it. But this is quick, it's simple, and it's absolutely delicious. Thank it's you, our Graham. fresh peppercorn steak. And again, that keyword is eat to double three, seven, two, eight. I didn't bring utensils, so I'm gonna it's have okay. to eat with my fingers. <laughs>